Hi guys and welcome to Quarantine Classroom. Today we're going to learn about surface tension through an experiment. The first thing you're going to need is milk. Then you're going to need some food coloring. You can use any colors you want. And we're just going to place single drops inside the milk. Don't put too many. So we're going to have different colors of food coloring that you want. Then you're going to need a Q-tip and we're going to dip that in some soap. And then we're just going to press it into the food coloring and let's see what happens. Isn't that super cool? Yeah, so it's moving around and let's see if we dip it back into the dish soap. Wow, look at that. Super cool, right? Let's figure out what happened. All right. So there's this thing called surface tension, and it's in liquids like water, juice, coffee, and other drinks. And it's basically a net, an invisible net or a web that's on top of the liquid. So let's think of a raindrop. We see that it's circular and it holds its shape, right? But that's really the invisible net or the surface tension that's helping it hold its shape. So what about the experiment? The, basically, the milk has surface tension too, like water, and the food coloring floats on top of the milk. And when we add soap, it basically breaks the net or the web so that the food coloring can move around easily. Let's think about when we wash our hands. We use soap, right? So basically, the soap breaks the surface tension of the water and it helps us remove the dirt and that bad stuff. So if we didn't use soap, the dirt and bacteria would basically just stay on our hands, and we don't want that. All right, back to the experiment. So we know soap breaks the surface tension of milk, so the food coloring can move more easily. But also, soap gets rid of fat, right, when you're washing dishes? And the soap likes the fat in the milk, so it interacts and they react, and that's why we get all those swirls and movement in the milk. So next time, when your friend is like, oh, why do we wash our hands? You'll know the reason why. Just remember that soap helps break the surface tension in liquids or that invisible net and helps us more easily remove dirt or the bad stuff or, in our experiment, the food coloring. Thanks for watching and remember to keep on learning.